Right, I've been fiddling around with this for a while, trying to get this bloody mod to work to see if it is working now. I have put on a mod that means all car radios are off, so it means I can play with music on in the background. But I don't know if it's on by default. Let's have a look. This is working now, please. I've been fiddling around for about half an hour trying to get it to work. Uh oh. <laughs> Seems like it is. That was probably the mod that caused it to g glitch out, didn't it? It's just like, turn the car radio off. Is he going to do it every time, though? Maybe it's because it's the first time. Like, if I look at the radio... I can't even open radios no more. <laughs> they won't even let me put on a radio. I have, like, no choice with radios at all. Which is fine, I guess. There's no reason to put it on. But the button's disappeared. But if I press... I think it's U... Radio on. Yeah, there you go. Radio on at the bottom. Okay, so it's working now. I get in the car. The radio comes on. And I can also look at the radio. Get out of the car. You. Radio off. Get in the car. Can't control the radio at all. My thumb. The button won't come up and it's off. Thank God. I've sorted it. Good. Because that means we can now get fucking music. Normally. In the background. Soundtrack music. I've also boosted the uh, dialogue up a little bit because I've noticed it was a bit quiet compared to SFX. Okay, cool. I don't know why it isn't an option to do that because like on that menu, it says radio station off. What's the point in having that option if it's always going to turn things on for you? Well, let's crack on with the simi on. What? No, what are you talking about? Something like that. Excuse me. Wait. That oh, wait, boy, I, I, I am his mentor. Hello. I am so proud of you. What do you mean, a mentor? Don't worry about that. Okay, so what you got for him? James De Santa. Some kid. He is already late on his payments, and I have this bad feeling that he will do more damage to the car than we can get back from him in the exorbitant interest rate payments. Huh? Just go and get it. The house is on... Um, Hampstead uh, off Eclipse. It's an SUV. Yeah. Some Rockford Hills daddy's boy nonsense. Don't worry about it. Let's try to bring the car back in good condition, huh? Gotcha. Don't worry about it. It's so good to see you, my boy. Hey, good luck in uh, law school, huh? Law school? So, Mr. Bennett, were we at uh, financing? Is that for that guy's benefit? This is the guy that uh, we saw in the yellow car. This is his old MO, isn't it? He sells people cars and he steals them back. <laughs> Hello? Hey, did you change your mind? When I discover that you betray me, perhaps. I hear you took the bike for yourself, my employee of the month. No, that wasn't me. Me and Lamar was gonna get that back to you, dawg. Oh, I am sure. You will get this car off the daddy's boy, and then we talk. Insurance papers say they have a locked garage, so you'll need to gain access from inside the house. Man, it's never easy with you, is it, Simi? Do not talk to me about easy, you thief. I didn't steal that bike. Lamar did. That was much louder, though, wasn't it? Dialogue. Much better. I feel like it's a bit quiet compared to some of the sound effects. Can it be boosted twice, though? I put the dialogue boost up and it took up like half the bar. I don't know if I want it that much. It was louder. It's a bit of a happy medium. I'll see you afterwards when I go to editing. But this is nice. Getting the car back from a rich kid. Let's hope nobody's home. If we're going inside the mansion. Uh, it's obviously not a pull up to the gate. Find a way into the house. Very nice house, hmm? You think this will be open? No, there is a camera there. Do they mind if I just jump over? <laughs> We've got like a ring door fucking cam- Oh! How do I take him out? When in stealth mode, moving around will generate less- I am in stealth mode, right? How do you take him out? I've, for I've forgotten. How do I do it? Just go up to him, press B. Yeah. God, the saturation of this is very high, isn't it? Do. Let's hope they don't notice that the annoying noise outside has all of a sudden stopped. Um, should I go around the back? This is where I need to go, right? right there's the car. Anybody in the kitchen? No? Is this unlocked? No? Okay. If you're in first person, are you sneaking? Still, yeah. 
This one? No? Sorry, did it tell me to go to a specific door? Did it want me to try the, the garage door first? Simeon said to sneak in through the house, though. Yeah, it doesn't work. Okay. Well, I mean, the front door's not going to be open, is it? I mean, some Americans leave the front door open, I guess. Would someone in the house like this leave it open if they're locking the back door? No. <laughs> I'm confused. But you see what I mean? We've got music now in the background. Good. Good. Don't have to worry about the fucking radio. I don't quite know what I'm looking for. Oh! Oh, it's the garden's got. Okay. It was just him, right? Does he have any other gardeners? To reach the open window, climb onto the car. Okay. That's where I'm meant to be. It's just because you have a massive gaper, bitch! Cool. <clears throat> Dad! Dad! He said I had a massive... Jimmy called me a bitch! How many people are home right now? Shouldn't we just wait until night time? In, please. Tried to oh. knife attack me? No one creeps on the J Dog, my niggas. Okay. So this is the rich kids. What's he plan? I'll cut your dick off if you call the administrator. Hey, you know what? I am the administrator. I don't care if you're twelve. I'll still rape you. <laughs> Quad four lobbies right there. <laughs> well, you suck Batman's dick. What's she doing? Oh my god. Seriously, my brother is such a homo. I think he has a medical problem. Like, more medical problems than the ones he's already been diagnosed with. <laughs> Mental ones. There's some blur there, Seriously, no? Seriously, penises are not meant to be that small. I fucking know, right? I've seen enough of them. <laughs> it's probably because he's so fat. What a massive slut. It seems like, is, is that blur? Sorry, where is that? It's like, in a distance, there's like some blur. Has it always been like that? What is that? Is there something on here and turn it off? Is that motion blur? Motion blur strength? No, motion blur's off. In-game depth of field effects. Is it that? These two kids sound fun, don't they? Oh, hello. Thank you, coach. Still a bit blurriness. Do I want to go this way? You're a real pro, Mrs. DeSanta. A real pro. No, you're a great student. Now just <laughs> loosen up those hips. Okay, like this? Yeah, loosen them up. There you go. And follow through. Perfect. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think I'm getting it. Okay. Car. Why Why does there keep being random explosions everywhere? Uh, what's this red blanket back here, huh? Take the car to the dealership. Let's go. Easy peasy. No one following us? Nope. Ring ring. Hey, Simeon. I got the ride, man. I'm coming back. Yeah, if you actually bring the repossession to me this time, I can have it back out on the street before the day is done. That wasn't me. That was Lamar. Oh, why's the camera changing? Oh. That's a nine millimeter semi-automatic pushed against your skull. Uh, well, look around. You just keep driving where you're going. Okay. Hey, come on, man. This was a repo job. Guy was behind on his fucking note. Unlikely, considering my son just got the car. And looking at the way you're going about this, my guess, you're working a credit fraud. A credit no. Fraud. Be serious, dude. I just worked the fucking repo. I said drive. It's a red light. I just worked the fucking repo. I appreciate a kid who follows orders without taking responsibility. Yeah, maybe one day we'll have a beer, and I'll explain how the world really works. Who gives you the slip? A car dealer, dawg, by the name of Simeon Yateri. So this businessman, he look legit to you? Look, man, it's just between him and your fucking son. Don't worry. Me and Mr. Yatarian, we'll work this out. Okay, I'm going, man. Can you put the gun down, please? Hey, man, it's Jess up here. Okay, stop the car. Pull up. Okay, please don't shoot. That the place? Yeah, this is the place, man. Whoa. Drive into it. Right through the fucking window. Huh? And fast. Or I'll put two rounds in the back of your skull and do it myself. Man, you can't be for real. I look like a fucking joke to you. Man, fuck my life, man. Fuck it. <laughs> right. Where are we heading? Man, I still got this gun to your head. It still seems a bit blurry in the distance, though. I did turn that field off. 
Hey, this guy, get away. Oh shit, I went, I went the wrong window. <laughs> I went the wrong window. <laughs> Sorry, Michael. <laughs> Hang on, let me try again. <laughs> It's not exactly how it looks. I always trump big for a job well done. Now get out of here, kid. I pulled the car back. You motherfucker! I won't be treated like this. Hit me. No? Oh, I've got to say, I finally got how to hit him. You? Wow. You think you could take me for See a me? ride? You that weak? Yeah. Sit down. Uh, 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 fucking asshole. Don't need to be like defensive. Get out of the shop. This is my shop now. You pissed me off. What is wrong with you? Oh, nice. Oh. You recognize this car? Huh? Does it look like it's worth five grand a month to you? You fucking racist. <laughs> Everyone's a racist. <laughs> I'm telling you, something. this thing's gonna need some serious body work for it's worth five grand a month. <laughs> Ah, he agreed to financing I have his signature. Yeah, did he agree to have some punk break into my fucking house? I, I don't know. I, uh... That kid might be a fucking idiot, but you are a fraudulent scumbag piece of shit. Oh. Don't make me have to come back here. Uh... I should still take the car, shouldn't you? Okay, we've unlocked Michael. We can now swap between Franklin and Michael. Cool. You think maybe we could like meet these guys up? Say again? How the fuck we get fired? Man, it was partly all that bullshit <laughs> you pulled, and partly the repos old man making me crash the car into the dealership. Ha! <laughs> you the crazy ass motherfucker in this partnership. You better spin them while you got them. Yeah, if you say so. I want to see if we can like get any interaction if we meet up. Is that Michael there? That is him, isn't it? Hello. Hey, Franklin, where'd you come from? Oh, hey. Uh, look, I'm sorry you got in trouble with the boss. Uh, you know, I'm sorry I broke into your house. Yeah, you're sorry you got caught. Nah, actually I ain't. You know, one door closes and that shit. All right, I'll tell you what, let's have a beer some. Sure. Uh, yeah, for sure, dog. I looked you up. We made friends quite quickly. What the hell was that? I would like to help. Really, I would. I feel like there's a crash. Loads of shit goes on right in this city in the background. Where's this from, Lamar? Dog, you've seen this monkey dude doing his street art shit around the city. Dude, this real man. Them some authentic ass lands. Huh? What? Oh, I have another email. Alright. Sure. Ammunition is saying I can go buy stuff. Okay. Does he have anything in his phone? He has emails too. One from, um, yeah, same ammunition. And I think this is our doctor. Progress and you'll see results. Dear Michael, very good seeing you yesterday. I want to stress how important it is that we continue therapy. We are on the point of a major breakthrough in your treatment. It's a fascinating process. When it seems pointless and exploitative is when therapy works the most. Hello? Life isn't meaningless. You're nice deeply to troubled, but together we can make you a functioning member Excuse of society. Me? I recommend you keep taking the medication, continue to read the books I gave you, and really try to understand what is causing these temper outbursts we'll crack you yes amigo we're in this together as you know i really enjoy working together you're a fascinating man michael but i'm afraid medicine in this country is not a charity and with that in mind i'm afraid i'm going to put my rates up again only by 75 percent which i think is very reasonable <laughs> given the stresses and strains of my work 75 percent doc i don't know if all this crap ain't working for me i'm just crazy and i don't feel like myself Anyone who calls themselves crazy isn't crazy. One moment I'm calm, the next I'm crazy. I just don't know what to do. Your rates again? Wow, yeah. Extortionate. Email back from the doctor. Dear Michael, keep practicing those breathing exercises and stop looking for people to blame. Come and see me soon. Fucking breathing exercises. They can help, but it's not like the answer for everything. What's over here then? I do remember there being like a bit of a crazy sort of uh, mission here. Is it this one? Legalize weed. Excuse me, sir. Can I talk to you for a second? The fuck are you talking about? I am talking about a hotline straight to heaven that this state makes illegal. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. I don't give a fuck about reform. No, no, they rigged the vote. I saw the ballots. It's a lie. 
It's democracy at work, amigo. Democracy can suck my fatty. <laughs> democracy only works when it lets intelligent people do what they want. This, this is tyranny by morons. <laughs> yeah, well, I got things to take care of in a little place called reality. You want to drag? <laughs> nah, I'm not a drug guy. He's tempted. This isn't bushweed. This is mana. Mana. I grew up myself. Mana. No paranoia, no weirdness. Do you mean like mana? Passport to Nirvana. Fuck, give me that. Yeah, here you really <clears throat> feel it. Yeah, I smoke all day and I'm fine. It's a pure, mellow high. Mm-hmm. But I do get concerned about the monsters. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> I mean... I'm sure they're nothing serious, but, uh... I never let them get to you. Oh, the fuck! <laughs> Where are we go? Is that a minigun? Nice. See what I mean when I said about like um, over the top GTA ness? There is that in this game, isn't there? <laughs> They're talking about like trying to keep mods realistic. There is a bit of sandboxy that goes in it. At least it forces you to do a bit of sandboxy. <laughs> Though I think most of this is really happening in our heads, right? I don't think we're actually shooting people right now. Oh my god! They're shooting me with their minds. Oh fuck! Uh, clearly, this weed has been laced with something. Weed doesn't do this. You don't hallucinate on weeds. Unless you've had a huge amount, I guess, in a very short space of time. Well, we had like, what? A couple of puffs? One or two puffs? Was he laced with something else? And the guy's like moaning about it not being legalized. Maybe that's why. And when did this originally come out? Like 2013? That's before. Legalization in um, LA, right? When did that happen? Oh! Michael has been abducted! <laughs> Stop here. Oh! Finished yet? Any more of you freaks out there? Oh! Oh, shit. Oh, feels so good. So, where exactly are we? Have we not moved? And after that, you see. <laughs> the liquor companies push for continued prohibition, which is complete insanity. What was I doing? Really? I'm thinking I can count on your support. The fuck just happened? <laughs> what are you talking about? We discussed globalization, the state. Stay the fuck away from me. <laughs> but it's a good cause. So I haven't actually hurt anybody. Oh? Have I? Why are the police on me? You kill me? Two stars. What did I do? What did I do in my drug state? Fuck. I didn't come here for a car. A lot more here than the Midwest. You said it. Why am I running like that? Hi. Am I not very good at running? Can I see my stats? Stamina is not much. Why he's right he's running really strange. <laughs> Run faster! I guess he is decently old. Oh no! Let's steal someone's car. Is there a car in here? No! I don't even know what I've done. The aliens weren't real, guys. Um, car? You know what? I actually don't think I need one. I think we might be good. Oh no, it's some time. Cool. No! Fuck. Need a car. That's a police car. I should have took a car. I should have took a car. I should have took a car. Does Michael have guns? He does. He has that pistol. I don't want to shoot back. As I'm about to die, then I will. Excuse me, fat ass. Coming through. Let's go down here. You have run out of stamina, pushing your body in harder will cause you to lose health. Shit. 
We'll get the gun out just in case. Need to shoot back. Need a car. What the fuck? <laughs> Got myself in the right pickle. <laughs> Shit. Fuck. No. 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 Fucking ran to a police station. No. Give me a car. Give me. Me trying to be like. Fucking. Oh. Why did they have the one me to start with? I should have just stole someone's fucking car. Me trying to be like a. Non criminal. <laughs> Get Michael killed straight, pretty much straight away. <laughs> well, killed, I should say. Medical center, hospital bills. Why does he walk like that? Fred? He's got a terrible posture, hasn't he? He's so sluggish. Right? He feels so heavy. Tell the years have not been that kind. Well, just not that kind. They've been not too bad, right? His hair's all still intact. He's put on a little bit of weight. Still alive. But there's definitely a difference from his youth. That prologue mission, he moves way more fluidy than he is now. I still think sounds are a little off. Cars seem a bit flat in their sounds. What's happening here? Various events unfold across San Andreas. These events will become blipped on the radar when nearby. You, please help me. Help you. Hey, you. Aren't you gonna help me? Why would I help her? Is there a reason why I would? Right, mate. Stop. Whoa. You still love. Hey. Hey, my fucker. Get the gun out. Say that out. Say that out. No. Oh. <laughs> Gotta tell you, Mike, Mike, Michael's a little fucking terrorist, mate, compared to Franklin. Wait. This guy, man, how is he still running? Okay, we need some sort of mod to fix that sort of stuff. He shouldn't be able to get bouncing back up and running off. Wait. The hell? Tell the difference between RDR2 and this, can't you? Mate, stay down. <laughs> gotcha. I mean, I didn't. $500. If you achieve a stolen item, you can choose to keep it or return it for a reward. Do you think we would get a better reward by turning that back than $500? Hmm? Do I need $500? I did lose some money in hospital bills. I'm keeping the money. <laughs> this looks nice. It's unlocked. Why is this car unlocked? Some random encounters reward the player with stat boosts or money. Mm hmm. We'll also get money from that man. $500. That ain't gonna get me better than that, right? Right? <laughs> but messed up. This car's good. Is the other member this car? Is this a new car? This did so nicely. I say nicely, so it's still arcadey. There's it's no weight to it at all. I mean, look at this car. What the fuck, man? Since when could cars be like that in story mode? I wonder if um, online now updates assets in story mode? That's an online thing, isn't it? Doing a car up like that. I've done a car up like that before. Not in story. I thought it was like a DLC for online. Who the hell is this? Not now. Hello? Message for me. Get off your fat ass. Are you talking to me? See this uh, exercise stuff's about as relaxing for you as it is for my wife. No, I don't want to sleep with you. And no, I don't care that I'm <clears> 39 <throat> and single. It doesn't worry me a bit. Easy. I'm go. not stressed out at all. Now go fuck yourself. Are you okay? Yes, I'm okay. Just fuck you. All of you. I'm on a run. Mm. Yeah, well, you seem a little upset. Seems like you're also on something else. Run you into the fucking ground. <laughs> okay. Hey. I played high school football, all right, sweetheart? All state, QB. Whatever. Just don't have a coronary. 
Let's go. <laughs> no chance, mate. Look at me. Okay, ma'am, boobs, race you to the beach. I don't know who I'm more embarrassed for. You're not exactly dressed for cardio. It's running. How much gear do you need? I feel like I'm being chased by my creepy uncle. <laughs> yeah, if your uncle was the same age as you, you mean? Although that would explain a lot. Fuck you! Why are you so angry? I'm not angry. I'm exercising. She's on that coke. How's that prostate holding up? What? What a weird thing to say. You say it because I'm getting old. It actually looks like I'm sweating, right? My back of my I can't shirt tell is. If you're loving this or hating it. Dirty. What if I was dressed more appropriately? She would say something. You still with me? Down this way. Run on the road. Take that traffic head on. Yeah, I could have guessed you were one of those. Call the exercise, you lazy idiot. <laughs> I can hear you wheezing. Oh, you can run faster. So you'll start sprinting. Oh, we've overtaken you. Look at that male pride go. Oh. You make me feel well adjusted. This is so tragic. This is where the psychiatrist's house is. Sorry, sorry. Uh, you should really think about behavioral medication. Oh my god, what's happening there? Okay, here we go. Last push. Come on, flick the switch. What's happening there? I think that guy's giving CPR. I thought I had issues, but you, you give me hope. I love you. My shrink's office is right near here if you want to work through some of that shit. Yeah, because you're a walking advertisement for therapy. <laughs> yeah, that's what I said. This game's so good, isn't it? Rockstar's so good at making living worlds. Come on, Carbs. Don't let me down now. Come, come on. Final push, Michael. Come on, beat her. Come on. Give no, yes, people block it up. <laughs> Not too shabby, huh? You can have that one on me. I never got out of second gear. I already did a 10K today. Oh, yeah. Whatever gets you through it. Oh, my chest. Can we bring that lifeguard over, please? Screw you! You're lucky I'm tapering for a try! Did she just steal that? New contact, Marianne. Mission passed. Contender. I guess that was probably from winning. Right, I've just gone and installed a Euphoria mod because I was annoyed at that mugging guy I shot and I shot him in the leg and he just got up like it was nothing. So I've got on a new mod before the video ends, similar to the one in RDR2 that I got to make people a bit more like RDR1. Why did that guy come into the car park and leave? <laughs> I was hoping he was going to get out and I could shoot him, but I'm near the beach. So um, this is a bit more of a demo, really. I need to make sure it's working. But basically, people should react better to being shot. So if I shoot down this person in the leg... I should hopefully react a bit better, right? See, look at her. That's better, right? She's like bled out then, actually. She's just fucking died. I, don't, I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> um, can I try on someone else just to double check? I think that did work, though, right? It definitely seemed um, a bit more realism. A bit more like the one I used in Red Dead. And a bit more like RDR1. It's ridiculous that all these games try and get a bit more like RDR1, isn't it? 10 years ago, because it's much better how they react. I think these people are reacting better. I think. Michael has a special thing to like bullet time, he doesn't seem to be able to do it yet. This is better though, isn't it? I think. I don't think they normally do that, do they? Right? There's a load of other things it does. It's the Euphoria mod. Is that what it's called? The, uh, the Wero? Or Eero. Might be similar to actually the one that was made for RDR2 that I installed. I can't remember, but I have a mod list like below that I constantly update if you want to grab it yourself. Have a look. It does loads of different things that I can't remember off the top of my head. But one of them is like shooting people in the leg and they should bloody well stumble, right? Not, don't just get up and carry on running like nothing happens. So maybe we can sort of just go out guns blazing with these police actually in this gunfight. Let's see. If we notice any difference. I think there is, right? They had stumbling been shot. It does seem like this is working. I don't normally do that, do they? This guy is like fumbling around on the floor. Right, I don't think that's um, vanilla. Right, 
for it. Do they do normally do that? I don't think so, right? <laughs> So much for like um, having realism in the story. This is to check the mods working. Okay, all right. This Michael Canically is just a fucking homicidal maniac. Everything we've done with him so far has been like ridiculous, hasn't it? <laughs> Go back to the hospital. We're gonna get well known with the doctors. Come on, guys. You wanna um, pop me? Yeah. All right. So I think that's working. Right, they looked like they were more dynamic when you shot them, right? I think. We'll see how that goes. Uh, another thing it should be that there should be some sort of push back when you try and um, drive people over. Like they hold onto the car rather than just flop in instantly. I don't know how far she needs to do that. Yeah, like that. Okay, so it is working, but they hold on to the car, right? I don't think they do that normally, right? So that's working too. Okay, it's definitely working. Good. It's one of the things it lists, right? When you run people over, they try and do the GTA 4 thing when they grab on. That's from GTA 4, isn't it? I recognise that. I, d I definitely don't remember playing GTA 5. They normally just hit the floor, right, when you hit them. So it's definitely working. It's definitely working. Good. Good, good, good. Big improvement. Franklin's car is still here. He hasn't come and collected it. All good stuff so far. Keep adding new mods like that to improve the experience. No radios and now paired overhaul. Good. Might look at seeing some police. Overhauls too would be good, maybe. If there's any fun ones. So this is Michael's house, yes. All the same stuff as Franklin. Just a bit more posh. We don't actually have too much money, to be fair, for someone living in such a lavish house. I wonder why we are living in such a lavish house. Hmm? We have seven and a half grand, right? I mean... I guess, is that there in my pocket? I, I forget, I think that might be just in my pocket. Or is that money in total? No, it's not like online, right? You don't get a pocket. It's just your total money, yeah. That's not a huge amount, right? I mean, I've got seven and a half grand, something to sniff at, but someone living in a house like this, is that all he has? Might be asset rich and cash poor. So the doors unlocked this time. Hmm? Why was it locked during the day for Franklin, father and son? Uh, what kind of music is this? God damn it. <laughs> this will be muted. I don't care anymore. You alright, mate? What are you doing here? Why is he here? Ah, uh, really? I wasn't really serious about that. What? That was from us talking on the street. Yeah, here, whatever. Sit. I didn't say that during the actual mission, did I? You ain't gonna rob me again. Man, I never robbed you. That was just a repossession. Okay. You call it whatever you want to call it. I really don't care. What can I do for you? Shit, I just came by to see if there's something I can help you with. I see you doing well for yourself. Look, I'm retired. Ain't you a bit young for the pipe, slippers, and staring at a fucking sunset? You know, I've been in this game for a lot of years. And I got out alive. That makes me the right age. How old is it? Forties? <laughs> you look like a good kid. But if you want my advice, you give the shit up. You work hard, screw over everybody that you love. Hurt, rob, kill indiscriminately, and maybe... Just maybe, if you're lucky, you become a three-bit gangster. It's bullshit. Go to college. Says the man who just shot everyone up. People off and get paid for it. It's called capitalism. Hmm. So what I saw the other day was like when a corpse briefly reanimates itself and terrorizes everyone, right? I have been a terrorist. What you saw the other day. I'm a big hypocrite. Was a guy dealing with pests. 
guess I never saw myself as just a fucking pest. Well, then today's lesson's all about humility. Tomorrow we'll try a training montage. A training what? Gonna need a montage. I was just lost in an 80s movie fantasy. <laughs> yeah, I can see you spend a lot of time there. Yeah, as much as I can. So that's why you're here in Vinewood then, right? Maybe I'm here because I'm just an idiot. Who thinks that imported palm trees are a good substitute for not really knowing what the fuck you're doing on this earth. Jesus, man. You a good time, you know that. i tell you what. <sighs> least I can do is buy you that beer. There's a little bar I like. <sighs> it's not too far from here. I must have said Let's that during a mission. All right, man. I'm following you. Right? I thought it was just me talking. Like, um, in that little interaction I had afterwards. I must have missed him saying that. In the actual mission, it would make more sense, because I thought it was a bit out of place that he's saying about buying him a beer. <sighs> Let's take Amanda's car. Yo, yo, yo. Hey, Jim. I'm going for a drink. Dad, right? shit. I mean, our boat going down the Western Highway. It's, it's been stolen. What? The yacht's been stolen? I, I was trying to sell it. I know you didn't want it sold, but I need money, and they don't want to buy it. They just want to take it. I'm hiding in the head. You're insane. All right, I'm coming for my boat. All righty then. Change of plans. My darling boy is in trouble. I do what I can to help with that, man. Okay, let's take my wife's car. That's why his car was parked out front. Then he was like hanging around the side, was he? It was parked in the place I left it though. So maybe he did come to collect his car and decided to just come inside. Lesson number one: Don't ever have kids. Hey man, look. If I had kids, I don't think no parenting issues would arise over who had both privileges and who don't. Shit, motherfuckers would be lucky to sit in the bathtub. Shit, things that desperate, huh? Nah, but you know, shit, I was making a point. Mythologizing self-deprecation. I know it well. Yeah, man, but shit, where the boat at? Little shit's been hijacked. They're somewhere on the Western Highway. Man, ain't you worried? About my boat? Yeah, I am. But you can always buy another boat. Yeah, tell my accountant that. Man, you can always get credit for one. But have you come repo it? No, thank you. <laughs> All right, homie. I ain't your homie. I'm someone you want to impress. Really? Man, I thought you was retired. Why the fuck do I want to impress some slipper-wearing motherfucker? Because I can still teach you a thing or two. Maybe help you open the door to all the joys that boat-related parenting issues entail. So I'm gonna help you get this boat back, right? That you are, my friend. This is an interview, Franklin. For my homicidal partnership. Oh, there, there, there it is. That's my boat. Yo, boat's in a fucking hurry, man. Yeah, well, we'll catch him. Get Franklin close to the yachts. Hey, what we about to do? I'm gonna get you close. And you're gonna go board that thing. Alright, man. Shit. Fuck it. Let's go. Jesus right, Christ. Piece of the glove box. They give you shit. I'll take them out. All that's cool, man. You shoot with one hand and drive it with the other. But my motherfucking concern is I might miss the jump and fall in fucking trap. You said you wanted to learn from shit. the best. Whoa. Crack lesson number one. Hey, you want me to do this shit? You better get this boat, man. Okay. Right, this guy's being a bit I'm of a menace. That's gonna hit the. Yep. You gotta take grip. Good. I can't do this shit from here. Get me close. Where are we jumping on the cell? Oh, god. Okay. I can talk with cinematic. I'm not doing that. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I am. Oh, fuck. What does it do to my driving? Am I still like driving, or do I crash? Get your ass out of here. Not the engine. Shit. Like, am I still driving? Fucking engine. Get away oh, it does. From him. It does still go. I wasn't pressing any buttons. So I was just like watching. Okay, cool. He shot my car. Then, Frank. You hurt my boy. Get the jump on him, Frank. Frank said. Shoot this motherfucker in the face already. Hey, this dude trying to kill me. Ah, too close. Hey, shoot this motherfucker. Jesus. That was a bit auto right there, wasn't it? That's odd. Um, I don't remember it doing that, right? You, I, I think I remember just sort of shooting out the car and it just shot without having to press two buttons. Eventually there'll be a video gone by where I'm not opening the pause menu. Drive by control time, here you go. Yeah, just fire, I think. Right? I don't remember pressing two buttons before. Okay, now go find Jimmy. Dad? Wait, you're the guy from the dealership. 
Yeah, and it's a long story, bro. Jimmy! Oh! Kid, watch out for the boom! Fuck! Hold on! I'm trying! Oh, I've gone past. Jesus Christ. What is going on in the boat? You better hope she's still seaworthy. Ah, this is gonna kill me. Can we could be controlling Franklin though? No. Ah, oh, Let's do yeah. some interesting shit on that boat, isn't he? Oh, kid. You right? Come on, kid. Come on, kid. Ah, crap. Well, what does he want me to do? Did it say? Shit. Ah, shit. You want to get back in the car? Oh, closer, man. Close. Yeah. Okay. What the fuck? Remind me not to come to you for parenting advice. Do we want the boat still? Yeah. All the fucking board. Let's stop this ship from sailing. Go on, man. Sit down. Let it go. Let it go. Oh no. Now that doesn't sound good. That's the engine, man. We ain't taking shit in this thing. Hold it together. Ah, my fucking boat. Ah, oh, we lost the boat. Hey, it's just a thing. At least you still got a son. Hey, it's a chop shop back there, dog. You drive us there, we can get the ride fit. Sure. Los Santos Customs, okay. My boat. It's just a thing. My boat. Please stop doing that. Listen, I fucked up, okay? I'm not going to lie. That was a really bad judgment call. But shit, Dad, I nearly died. And all you give a shit about is this fucking boat. No, it's not that. It's all we do is scream at each other. No wonder I can't get a job. It's all your fucking fault. Or it's not, but it's partly your fault. I, I mean, I just want to impress you. By selling my boat to some gangbangers? I know it sounds dumb when you put it like that, but all you do is daydream or get angry. Look, I love you, Jimmy, but you're an asshole. And right now, with my boat disappearing over the horizon, that's all I can see. Franklin, do you do me a favor and give this kid a ride home after they fix this thing? I want to headbutt the road in peace. Oh, great. Leave me with the home invader. I'll get it done, dog. No problem. Dad! Enough, all right? Enough. Franklin, do me a favor. Call me a taxi, will you? Sure thing, man. Hey, I need a cab as soon as you can send one. Los Santos Customs, by the airport. All right, thanks. Thank you. Hey, so you uh do much yachting? Not anymore. No, I don't. Before, I mean, man. No, no, not really. This little shit stays in his room all day, and I don't have any other people to go with, you know? I like looking at it. Looking? Yeah. <laughs> you know, I come down to the marina, sit on the dock, pour myself a drink, and look at her. Jacqueline. Did it clear my head, you know? Let me dream. Jacqueline, huh? Well, maybe you need to do some other shit to fill your time. Dream other dreams, man. Yeah, sure. Whatever. Hey, this the place up here. I know this dude, man. His name How. He gonna look after. All right, take what's in my pocket. A couple thousand bucks. That'll cover it, right? Yeah, it should be cool. Good. Hmm. It's probably less than that. So you sure you're good? Yeah, I got this. All right. Ooh, uh, I'm gonna come up front. Get out and walk around. It's okay. I can just climb over. Look, man, I'm gonna get the ride fixed, man. And drop it back off at your house along with this dude. It's all good, though, man. You gonna get your head right, all right? All right, listen, thanks for today. I appreciate it. You stop back out to the house, we'll talk. Ugh, you see? So, man. Hey, sorry we didn't get your boat, man. Yeah. Come on, man. Let's trick this whip, homie. Shut up. Welcome to Los Santos Customs. 24 hour repairs. I bet it only costs like 500 bucks to fix it. This guy, I think, sells you races or sorts out races. How? Like street races? Still need to get you out for one of the races, Franklin. Mm -hmm. so if you drive as fast as you talk, it's actually free. Like Recondition, sweet. Really? He has. He did actually give me a couple of grand. Right? I didn't have so, two thousand five hundred, Franklin. What do you think? I can uh, actually customize it all up. I didn't realize you could do that single player custom. Do we want to do that? We go like pimp up his wife's car. <laughs> I won't um, change any of the actual specs. But can we do it up? Ooh, mama ain't going to recognize this bitch. <laughs> Is there anything else we could do? Like skirts? I gonna be embarrassed to borrow this thing. Uh, I don't really like them. Put a spoiler on Toy it. Boy's going to flock to my mama in this ride. 
I don't really I don't actually like him to be fair. Slam the bitch, F dog. It's not worth it. Power God, that actually it actually costs a lot. I didn't realise the prices. Penis. Yeah, we won't. I guess what we could do is we could change the colour for her. How much is a respray? Yeah. <laughs> oh, still quite a bit. Yeah. Got like a very garish colour. The Barbie colour. Oh, that looks you know what? You know what? Oh yeah, paint you. I actually kind of like that. I don't think that looks too bad. What else can we do? Like, no, leave the secondary color. I, I've changed my mind. Can we do something else? But now, now try the spoiler. This wagon gonna be sick, homie. Yeah, that looks kind of cool. Sure. And uh, hmm. Bumpers? Gonna give this lady some curves? STD. No, thank you. Rear Someone bumpers. Say body kit, yo. No, I think maybe that'll be fine. But Changing a, in its bloodstream. Not Choosing. all that much stuff, otherwise, really, I don't think it's worth my it. Car had as no. Work as my mama. Can you shush? Oh, shit. That's where it's at. Is her name really Crystal? Wow, that's not a stripper name. Did we marry a stripper? Recognize this bitch. Yeah, there's nothing else here I'd like, to be fair. What about rims? Can we put like some ridiculous rims on here? Let's get some sick ass rims. Oh, they, no, they cost too much. Look how much they cost. No, no, no. You got any like cheap ones? No. Okay, yeah, no, we're not doing that. I just spent, how, I just spent about a grand on a car I'm not even going to use. Does it stay like this outside her house? It's, it is an upgrade, Dude, isn't it? What's happening? <laughs> it's definitely a sort of boy racer, boy racer type of upgrade, though, isn't it? Not so much a, a Barbie girl trophy wife car, which I think is what she is, isn't she? Michael's wife. Okay, let's go home. All right, man, I'm taking you home. It's Franklin, right? Yeah, Franklin, or the credit for our guy, the home invader. You know what? Call me what you like, man. Yeah, I, I, no, I, I mean. Sure. Jimmy, ain't he? Or James? Jimmy. Or just like... Jizzle? <laughs> Jizzle? No, man, I'll just Don't say that. Jimmy, homie. So, uh, what's the deal, man? Huh? You and my old man? I see you at the dealership, then someone steals my whip, and Pop is all like, he's been down there to talk to you guys. Yo, Pops did more than talk. What'd he do? Look, man, if he ain't tell you, I ain't gonna tell you. But I lost my fucking job, and I thought maybe he could help me find a new one. Dude, my dad is retired, like fully. Like his only marketable skills are watching TV and daytime drinking. Oh, man, look, I don't know, homie. He seems okay to me. Shit, he saved your ass. You saved my ass. Nah, nah, man. Well, well, maybe we good together, you know? Like maybe we can get shit done we couldn't do separately. If it keeps him out of the house, that's cool by me. <sighs> yeah, well, we'll see. Look, I'm sorry my dad lost to your job. It's hard out there. Tough. I mean, I'm employmentally challenged at the moment. Oh, you got fired, dude. Damn, that's rough. Not fired as such. I didn't get a job. I've been there, homie. You've been putting them resumes out there, but no one's hiring, huh? No, I, uh, I didn't get a job. I've never had a job. It feels like hard work. Life, the days just kind of disappear. Hey, you play right to slaughter? Nah, not since the first couple. Okay. True that. If that is meant to be the Call of Duty clone, Call of Duty is dead nowadays. At least it is to me. I used to buy that game like religiously every year until Ghosts was the first one where I stopped doing that. And I haven't really played it since. That amazing fish AI. Right? <laughs> was that the meme <laughs> at the time? Was that to do with fish? Yo, so like, since we're both unemployed, like, we could run together, you know? Yeah, I think about it, homie. Or. Or we could just like shop it, you know? Play darts or get our drink on. Strip clubs. Come on, dude, I get real crazy. Yeah, I got your number, shit, I need it, man. But, uh, hey, hey you know what? Man, go easy on your pops, dog, all right? All right, church. <laughs> exactly, man. My brother from another mother. I mean, I, I hope so, because my mom was kind of a skank back in the day. See ya. Yeah, whatever, homie. Peace. Hope your mom likes the new car paint. Uh, Jimmy? 
Yo, F Dog, I have added you on Life Invader. Accept my request and we can hang. Hit me up anytime, bro. Anytime. And we go in. Chop it. Peace, Jizzled. Don't call yourself Jizzle. <laughs> Is that true? Life Invader? You sent me a friend request. Um, it still only says 14 friends. I don't think I did that to you. What have we got on here since the last time I looked? Last time you get up my face about making dumb moves, you got us fired by stealing the bike. Basically, right? I, I guess I did crash through the window. That wasn't my fault, okay? I had a gun to my head. Travel Clinton. Travel Clinton? I've never seen so many crazy death wish drivers in Liberty City. You'd fit right in here. I think this is my brother? Tavel? Right? Clinton's my last name. Is Tavel my brother? Who's Tavel? Patient barista. He might be my brother, right? He looks a bit like our mum. I think that's our mum. He's got way more friends than me. Yeah, family too. Yeah. Okay. What's he doing now in Liberty City? Got a job as a barista. A bit weird that people actually use the train in Liberty City. Can you not do that in this game? It's not Tony McTony. It's mad, right? Uh, all this stuff that Rockstar adds in the background. So, what we got in a moment? I think it's just missions with Franklin. It's one random Strangers and Freaks and a mission. Okay, sure. Let's look at what this is.